Hi, welcome to Draw Plans. I'm Tom Norris and today we're focusing on architect title blocks. Um, so most people know what architect title blocks are, but um, they can be tiresome and troublesome when you start to scale them to fit the paper space. So if we have a look at um, our one of well, what I would consider to be this a standard size um, architect title block would be this one because most of the drawings we do we start at 1 to 100 that's the scale and for that we use an architect title block that's 9000 mil wide 2000 mil high now I'm going to show you how this works so what, I, what I'm going to do is just going to copy it and control C and I'm going to come down here and now we're going to go to mo uh, paper space at the same scale 1 to 100 so as you can see, we've got um, an architect title block in there and it's this size because it's being scaled, scale to suit. Uh, so let's go now, let's, assuming, let's assume we have to create a drawing, uh, but the scale would be 1 to 150 or 1 equals 50. So let's see what happens now if we use the same um, title block. As you can see it's twice the size we need. Now this one here has been scaled proportionately to reflect that it's 1 equals 50 rather than 1 equals 100. So again if we just for the sake of demonstration if we go down where we're working on 1 to 25, 1 equals 25 can see what the problem is now the architect title block is getting huge on the page so what I'm driving at is that the architect title block has to be scaled uh, much the same as the page uh, paper the paper space uh, so last one 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 ten one equals ten you can see now look at the architect title block is absolutely huge and useless so if you were having to print off in various scales then uh, you need to have your architect title block scaled correctly as well that's right so let's go back to model space and what we've done here is um, or what I've got here is I'm showing you the architect title block scaled for different pages uh, so up here it's t this little tiny one which well it looks tiny um, but it's actually for one and one and uh, let me just demonstrate that one on the paper space there you go it's you know, we've got one there already and that's one and one and it's the same proportions as all the other pages this one works uh, absolutely fine so back to model space we've got all of the architect title block scale to suit um, the most common pages uh, if we needed to make up a different one, or a, uh, then it would be a very simple matter to do it. But we have the majority of the ones, that, the common uh, scales that we use for our drawings. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to make up just a couple more uh, to show you how we do it. And what I suggest you do is uh, you start with 100 and then you scale up and down and you open up your paper space, create paper space um, pages here so that you can then insert uh, the appropriate sized architect title blocks. So uh, the next size up on one, five, one equal to 500 would be say one equal to 1000. So let, what we're going to do is we're going to scale uh, we're going to scale upscale one to one thousand. So all I do is make a copy of that, and we have a look at the sizes. So to upscale that, all you would really need to do is look at the size down in the inspector bar. It's forty-five thousand by ten thousand. So all we need to do that, if we're going to go five hundred to a thousand, well, we're, it's a very simple. Uh, upscale meaning we just double up on the numbers so here it, instead of 45 it would be 90,000 and this one instead of 10,000 would be 20,000 and now it's that simple it really is that simple so all we need to do now is to change here within the title block uh, change to 500 
to 1000 so that it reflects correctly and what I will do for argument's sake is to put this at 1000 and of course so that it it, it's, it's just so that it shows correctly I can double up here as well and now I've just created so we can we can create another page down here we can create another paper space page so that we can test this out so all I do here is I go duplicate and if I click on it I go in and change the properties so we have paper space that's 1000 and then we change the scale to 1000 and you can see what the old one looks like so we take that out and now we go back to model space and we take the correctly sized title block and we go into 1000 and that's it so we can pop that down we can pop it down into the corner you find the uh, the proper spot for it that's close enough for what we're trying to do here yeah, for what we're trying to achieve so you've now managed to create uh, a new paper space size at, with a scale of 1 to 1000 and you put in a correctly scaled architect title block uh, so let's go back we're going to do one more to make sure you got the idea so this time we'll double up again we're going to create uh, one at 2000 so I'm going to just move that out of the way for a minute and again we look at the numbers down here that's 90,000 so it should be 180,000 and this is 20 so it should be 40 one two three click and this is how you do it this is it is this simple so change this now to 2000 And let's resize that as well to 10,000. Hope you've got a head for numbers, uh, as you kind of need them. And now let's create another page again. Um, and I'm going to do duplicate. It's assuming it allows us. So we're going to duplicate again. And we click on the duplicate and we change the properties and this one is 2000 get rid of that and then change the paper base scale to 2000 and as you can see that's the old one so I'll leave the old one there for a minute and we'll bring in the new one at 2000 which is the correct correctly sized or scaled um, architect title block uh, for this paper space there we go so you see what the old one would have looked like it would have been tiny so the proportions have to be kept so whatever space paper space size you create or you need for whatever you're drawing uh, you need to have the correctly sized architect title block to suit the paper space so i suggest what you do is you make a template like we've done and you keep it so you keep it on file and basically uh if you if you're uh if, if you needed it then all you need to do is pop in uh to your template and pick up the block uh, so you wouldn't have to keep making them or duplicating them or rescaling them but it's a it's a simple little thing but it but it needs to be done and it's it's how we start off so we have uh, basically uh, scaled architect title blocks to fit all of the common pages and here with this is again as a this is a template uh, file that we use and uh, as you can see we've got all the standard paper space sizes uh, with uh, 
correctly sized architect title block in all of them. Uh, so that's how you do it. It's not rocket science, uh, but I think you should do it. And the sooner you do it, uh, the more professional you'll be when you present your plans. And um, it's just going to look good and it's going to be better all around. So yeah, get it done. Uh, brilliant. That's a, this is a short lesson. So this is all we're doing. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you on the next lesson. Bye bye.